wanted to do a quick video of the laboratory where I work doing all the projects uh, just to show you guys what I've got going on and if you have any suggestions for any new equipment or anything like that pretty cool just to see what's going on I'll start out real quick by the uh, robot table here it's pretty much where I keep all the completed robots or the ones that are assembled enough to uh, store over here out of the way of the work and sure enough there's a bunch of other parts and junk underneath but uh, starting at the workstation got a nice comfortable chair and keep my tools underneath and the table up here I've got a nice cutting board for all the messy projects so don't ruin the table got some basic uh, test equipment and, and parts laying around a lot of different part bins and just to keep everything remotely organized I just cleaned the place so it's usually never this clean got some tunes to listen to nice open area some more storage of some random parts got a lot of routers at the moment doing some Wi-Fi projects but I uh, try to keep things organized got um, pretty much like my power all my batteries and uh, wall warts and adapters and a lot of this is audio visual stuff some Wi-Fi parts and just miscellaneous things that I keep going on got another light with some cat5 cables just if I need an extended light the blue cap and crunch whistle if you know what that's for, what that is, uh, congratulations. And over here I got some laptops where um, the netbooks I pretty much just grab and go when I need them. The uh, iBook and the ThinkPad I use for some legacy projects and some PowerPC. That's an old iBook with PowerPC processor. I like to keep that accessible right there. Got some Arduinos and some random other electronic parts that I like to keep handy. Some CDs and uh, pretty much my quote-unquote network backbone. Got my, my routers and switching units here for the whole house. Nothing too big. Uh, RoboSapien I'm not even using right now. Uh, printer and stuff like that. Some more power chargers. Got an old scanner I like to listen to when I get bored. Another laptop. And my current project is an embed project I'm working on with, with LAN. But I got a nice table space there so I can pretty much swing from this table. This is where I usually sit on this chair. My main system, uh, my Atom N330 with the Ion, NVIDIA Ion graphics, pretty much runs all my basic programming, similar stuff. My other PC monitor, which is um, an Athlon X2 system, they're all pretty old now, the bigger monitor for the Ion. And I like to keep this workspace kind of clean for the keyboard access, but I spend most of my time, I can just turn it around over here, start working, and then I've got... Uh, that Athlon system that I was talking about for the smaller monitor, all exposed, sitting out here. I've got another Pentium 4 system that I use for testing and all kinds of random stuff. Uh, plug it in as I have to go if I need to use it. External CD-ROM drive. This is the box PC. There's a video on that if you guys want more information. And this is right to my right, so I can just swivel around. Um, this is my server, which I'm currently undergoing work on, but that's usually sitting on the floor just nice room for when people bring in computers and stuff to work on got a little test monitor here and and then right on the side I got my parts bins which contains mostly PC parts uh, try to keep most of the robot parts on the tables to keep them separate but in case I never need anything or run anything I, I can grab it right there and that's pretty much the overview of my laboratory so just showing you where I get all these projects done and space that I've got to to utilize so I hope you enjoyed it you know take a little break from the electronic project side and just to see what uh, my little labs like so hope you enjoyed it